Hey guys, it is Ash and welcome back to another video. So as you can see by the title, I'm going to be um, reacting to embarrassing photos of me from when I was young till now. So that's going to be fun. <laughs> so you should definitely subscribe and go and check out my Instagram. But yeah, let's just get right into exposing myself. Why not? Okay, so I'm quite nervous. I don't know why I'm nervous. <laughs> okay, so um, we have my mother and father, and then we have myself. Um, I think we should just take a moment to appreciate my shoes. So they definitely fit perfectly, which is why I'm so chuffed. I mean, look at that look on my face. Oh, that was so cute. I, I don't remember anything about that day. Okay, so we should do... I'm going to go in like a timeline so that you watch me grow. Watch me progress through life. I should probably leave a space for you guys so you can see the photos. I'll insert them there. Is this annoying? Maybe that's annoying. I'll go that way. The next photo is me with my kitten patches. She went, she went missing. She never came back. When she went missing, I found like a bits of her hair on my bed where she used to lie, and I took her little hair and I like put it on over sticky tape and put it in my diary, so I wouldn't forget. <laughs> oh, oh no! How old was I? Yeah, and what comes first? Okay, I'm a bit muddled up in my own timeline. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> this photo is so cute. So this is my mom and I. As you can see, my hair was just gorgeous. Oh my goodness, look at that little dress. So I was a little pudgy on the arms, as I can see there. So here we have an interesting photo of my sister and I on the trampoline, wearing matching outfits. Um, I'm not sure why the both of us look like we need the toilet. I. I yeah i mean pink and white straps is, is a look i mean i was doing well at that age i'm not really sure about my face okay so here we are on a beach and i have a milkshake this photo is funny because i actually posted this on my social media like i thought this was a really good photo like i was really chuffed with myself with this one i mean my hair's a bit in my face but you know, maybe that's the look I was going for. I'm not sure. Okay, next we have a picture of me on the beach trying to make it look like I can do some form of acrobatics. I'm not really sure what I thought this was going to prove because it kind of proves that I'm not at all flexible and I can barely lift my leg. On the bright side, at least I look pretty tight. <laughs> I just, I don't know don't know what I was trying to do. Moving on. Okay, so next we have... Oh, this is quite a cute photo of my mom and I. As you can see, I was going for the nerd innocent look. And then the top looks like it was probably from JJ's. I'm not sure if anyone else had JJ's, but if you're from South Africa, you definitely know JJ's. And that top looks like it was from there. <laughs> Sorry if the lighting keeps changing. Um, England's being England and we're having four different seasons in 10 minutes. So that is that. Next we have a picture of me with a balloon. Why do I look so tanned though? It's kind of a look. <laughs> Here we have a photo. Um, I mean this photo is literally iconic. I... <laughs> Not only do I have Sepurgas on with the socks with the frill my hair to the side and creases in my forehead. I mean, that's enough to just tell you exactly what was going on and the time that I was in. Oh no. It was funny because everyone was wearing sapogas with those frilly socks. Like that was a look, that was like the thing. If you lived in South Africa and you were like 14 years old, 13, 14, don't tell me you never wore stuff like this, because you did. But. Yeah, there's, there's not much more I can say about this. I'm just kind of scared of it. And I want to press delete and never look at it again. 
I just didn't, I don't understand why I thought that that facial expression was attractive. Thing is, why did I crease the forehead? Okay, here, this is funny. Anna, if you're watching this, this is hilarious, but... I, this is this reminds me of like our pod days. We were going to a Sharks rugby match and this is what we wore. Can we please just take a moment to appreciate how short my shorts are? Like, I'm sorry, mom. I do not understand what you meant by short shorts. Those were short, short shorts. Those were very small shorts. <laughs> but I love how we covering our faces with the lip to nice to you. That's quite cute. Hey, okay, next up we have, I'm pretty sure that this, this picture's The sun just came out to play, as you can see. But I'm pretty sure this picture speaks for itself. I mean, I'm cooking, so that's a good thing, but I'm cooking bacon. So it's not that impressive, but I'm still cooking. And I was proud of myself, and this moment was captured because this was the day I became an independent woman who knew how to cook. Okay, let's get more recent days. Okay, so here we have my first ever metric dance. Um, as you can see, I was very excited. I absolutely loved the dress that I hired. It was so beautiful. If I could have that as my wedding dress, I probably would. Things might change, but that dress was so stunning. I was so nervous as well. I spent like, I think, two, three hours doing my makeup. <laughs> Here's me and Chelsea hugging. Um, we were just super relieved that we came home from this trip that the school made us go on for two weeks where we slept and slept in a tent and ate food that we cooked which was basically just powdered mash, some provitas and oats. It was a good time. <laughs> but yeah, it, it was not like looking back at it, it was it was worth it. But I appreciated the toilet so much when I got back because we were like going to the bathroom in the dirt, like in a hole. So that was fun. That was just a pure, like captured moment of relief that we were home, which is quite sweet. So my next picture is of me. Uh, I am at a prize. I'm not sure how my head got to that angle, but I mean, I, I'm in a good mood and that's all I can't say. Next, we have my 18th photograph. I... Yeah, if you were there, or you're my mom, you will know how that night ended. And let's just say it ended in the toilet. Yeah, this morning I wasn't feeling great. Not one bit. <laughs> but yeah, we have um, Splashy. Um, if you were at Splashy with me, or you knew the shit that was going on you know that I was not the happiest. But I'm smiling and I'm pretending to be living my best life. And that's, <laughs> it's funny because it's not funny, but I'm just, I'm laughing because of the trauma almost. Like I'm just like, this is how I'm coping with it. Let's just change the picture. Okay, here we have rage. That's fun. This is a picture of all my friends in the lounge. This was the last night of rage, so it was really cute. And yeah, we were, I think we were, we didn't really know what we were doing. Yeah, we have a picture of me, looks like Louise is back with a McDonald's cup that definitely did not have a soft drink inside and my hair and a side ponytail. And this was 2019. I'm a little bit worried. <laughs> okay, next one, I have another photo of Ashley going out. Once again, looking very excited, very happy. We love to see it. But hey, we had uh, this day, I remember because I was getting a like a trial for my spray tan for my matric dance. So I got like the trial run done on that day because I knew I was going out. <laughs> so clever. Okay, so we choose one last photo. Oh, let's do this one. This is like me and my second mom. I miss her. Nothing else to say, I just miss her. How long have I been filming this for? 20 minutes! Alright guys, so that is the end of this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed all of these photos that I've shown you, please do like it because I have fully exposed myself. 
but if you really did enjoy this video and i hope that you did please don't forget to subscribe and go and check out my instagram and yeah leave a comment below about leave a comment below saying photograph photo i need to pick better words but if you've come this far then comment photo down below and i'll see you guys all again very soon thank you for watching and stay safe during this time bye